Can you believe it? Somewhere on Earth exists an extremely mysterious and bizarre place. Not only is it called the Gates of Hell, but human-like whales have even been heard coming from it. This is the limit of human exploration so far, the Kola Super Deep Borehole. What exactly is going on here? Back in the 1960s, the United States and the Soviet Union, as the two superpowers at the time, engaged in a prolonged arms race across various fields in vying for world dominance. Many cutting-edge technologies emerged from this backdrop. They competed not only in the space race, but also in underground exploration. To study the secrets of the Earth's interior, the United States planned an impossible-sounding undertaking to drill through the entire Earth. Upon learning of this, the Soviet Union immediately embarked on a similar plan, attempting to take the lead. This was the famous Kola Superdeep Borehole Project. In May 1970, drilling on the Kola Superdeep Borehole officially began. Initial drilling work went very smoothly, quickly reaching an astonishing 7,000-meter depth, becoming Europe's deepest borehole at the time. Greatly encouraged, the Soviet scientists immediately started the second drilling phase. However, affected by extreme high temperatures and pressures at the bottom, the drilling encountered many problems. Drill pipes were often jammed by falling rocks and drill bits frequently damaged. But this did not dampen the scientists' enthusiasm at all. By June 1979, the depth reached 9,583 meters, surpassing the American Bertha Rogers record to become the world's deepest artificial borehole. But clearly the Kola borehole's purpose was not just to surpass the United States. They even claimed at one point to aim for over 15,000 meters. By late 1983, the depth reached 12,000 meters. Though considerably slower than before, the 15,000 meter goal was within reach. They even developed an ultra-powerful drill rig for this. However, just as scientists prepared to continue deeper, the Kola drill bit transmitted a chilling sound, like wails from hell, as if countless people were crying out in immense suffering. Some believe they might have drilled into hell. Even worse, under constant high temperatures, an irreversible incident occurred. The 5,000-meter drill string actually broke inside. This meant the Soviet team had to return to 7,000 meters and start over, wasting years. It was not until 1989 that they reached 12,000 meters depth again. But by then, strange incidents frequently occurred. The borehole was blocked by unknown objects and drill bit damage rates increased. Eventually in 1993, depth was frozen at 12,262 meters. In the past decade, it had only increased 262 meters. But project funds were depleted. Coupled with the Soviet dissolution, drilling halted in 1994. Un unexpectedly, COLA research did not stop over the next decades. Extensive studies continued until 2006, when it was permanently sealed with a 12-ton steel cap and the 50-kilometer area designated a military zone. As for the hellish voice, it was later found to be from a 1970s horror movie. But undoubtedly, the Kola borehole remains the deepest vertical hole drilled by humans. Now over 30 years later, while technology has greatly improved, no country proposes similar plans, because even at 12,262 meters, it only reached 0.2% of Earth's radius. So drilling through the entire planet is essentially a human fantasy. <laughs>